Hi gamers, Total Bomb. We're live in Brazil with the new GameGear.be headset. We'll be discussing the new 7H Steel Series headset, and we've chosen the country of Brazil because we want to test this extreme gaming headset under extreme conditions. In this review, we'll be discussing the comfort of the headset, transport and durability, and of course, sound and noise cancellation. So, let's get started. I've now just put together the Steel Series headset, and I'll be wearing it the whole trip to see how comfortable it is. I just put on the fabric ear pads. Uh, you can also choose the leather ear pads, but because of it's so hot over here, uh, it's better to wear the, uh, the fabric ear pads. So we'll be walking for about one hour, one hour and a half, and I'll, after that I'll be judging how comfortable the headset it is to wear in these very extreme conditions. So let's go! We've been walking for about 40 minutes in the dry forest. It's really hot, but the headset is still feeling good. So let's go for the final 30 minutes and we'll see how it goes. Hi guys, I just came back from my one hour trip in uh, the Brazilian heat, now it's time for my conclusion. When we take a look at the headset, uh, the ear pads are not soaked with sweat, of course my ears are a bit moist just like the rest of my body, but overall I give it thumbs up for comfort, I never had a moment uh, during the trip when I was thinking oh my god I want to take these off because it's too warm or it's not comfortable. So I really can recommend these for comfort. Now let's move on to the next test. Hi everyone, we're at uh, Ipanema Beach in Rio de Janeiro for our second test. In this test we'll take a look at the noise cancellation of the headset and the microphone. I'll head back closer to the waves and do a very simple recording. Then we'll play it back and see how it performs. So, let's go! Okay, as you can see we're a lot closer to the waves. There's a lot of background noise, a lot of wind. Uh, we'll now use the window sound recorder to record a small piece, and then we'll play it back and see how well the Steel Series 7H performs. Okay, we're now recording a new soundtrack with the window sound recorder. Uh, I'll just talk for about five seconds. There we go, and now we'll see how well the headset performed. Okay, well the recording went fine, the sound is crystal clear, of course you hear a bit of the background noise, that's normal. Overall conclusion, the sound of the microphone is crystal clear, so it's perfect for LAN parties. As for the headset itself, uh, you must know it's passive noise reduction, so not active noise reduction. Um, it does cancel out a lot of noise in the background, so for me it's thumbs up for the 7H. Let's go to the next test. Hi everyone, we are now ready for the final test. In this test we will take a look at the durability and the transport aspect of the Steel Series 7H. For this test I'll take apart the headset. This means I'll take off the two ear pads and the cable. I'll then put it into this backpack, which will be put on a plane, two planes actually, two different flights, back to Belgium. So it will be a perfect test to see if the headset is strong enough to be transported in the most extreme conditions. So, the headset is in the backpack and is now ready for transportation. So, I'll see you back in Belgium and then we see how the Steel Series 7H did. See you in Belgium.
Okay, as you can see, the headset is still in one piece, so that's good news. Now for the final test, I'll connect my uh, 7H to the MP3 player and we'll see if the sound still works. Here we go. Perfect. Sound, sound is still perfect. This means the 7H passed the test with flying colors and get a thumbs up for transportation and durability. After a 14 hour flight to Amsterdam and a 2 hour drive back to Belgium, I'm really happy to be back home. We'll now quickly go over the different aspects of the Steel Series 7H and the test results we've got in Brazil. First of all, I think we can come to the conclusion that the Steel Series 7H is a true gaming headset. When we take a look at the transportation aspect, we can see that we can take off the headband, we can take off the ear pads, and we can take off the cable. All these things put together make the Steel Series 7H really easy for transport and therefore perfect for a LAN party. Then we have a very comfortable headband, we have interchangeable ear pads, which will give you the perfect fit in almost any condition. Then we have the ear cuffs who fit nicely and tightly around your ear and will cancel out a good deal of the background noise. And then finally we have the microphone which was able to cancel out virtually all the background noise and therefore it's perfect to take to a LAN party or play at any loud environment. So all these things put together we can say that the SteelSeries 7H is there for the hardcore gamer. So if you are one of those guys who plays for let's say hours and hours a day, you go to LAN parties, you play a lot of wars, then this headset is the perfect headset for you. If you guys have any questions, just post them below the video or send me an email at info.gamegirl.be. I hope you guys enjoyed this review and I'll see you guys next month.